Notorious Tacoma dog owner finally charged for animal cruelty. Deputies arrested Elmer Givens Jr. last night. If his name sounds familiar, it's because this is the third time dogs in his care had to be rescued, many showing signs of abuse. King 5's Lionel Donovan is at the Pierce County Sheriff's Department with more on this. Three times, that's shocking for a lot of people, Lionel. It absolutely is, Joyce, and the judge has set Givens' trial for April 22nd. Now, animal cruelty is a Class C felony here in the state of Washington, and that means that if Givens is found guilty on one of these counts, then he could face up to five years in jail. Currently, he's facing 59 of them. Good afternoon, Mr. Givens. Can the numbers speak for themselves. Elmer Givens Jr. faces 75 counts of animal cruelty. 59 of them are felonies, 16 of them misdemeanors. Deputies were first alerted to Givens back in November of 2019, where they found 48 dogs abused and malnourished. But last October, another 36 dogs were taken from Givens in the same conditions. Then, just last night... After two times of law enforcement being involved with him uh, and making clear of what is prohibited behavior, uh, the defendant has uh, gathered yet another 23 dogs. News of the abused animals left Tacoma residents shaken, and animal activists have spent the last year calling for Givens to be arrested and charged. And deputies say it was that level of community involvement that spurred their actions to move on Givens. When the charges were filed yesterday, it immediately hit all the community groups that were watching what he had been doing, and that started to spread like wildfire on social media which is why Animal Control decided to go out there last night. Uh, they weren't going to go out there last night, but they had to jump on it because the community feels so strongly about this case. Now that Givens is finally being charged, activists are relieved to see what they hope are the first steps in keeping Tacoma's dogs safe. My biggest fear, and it's the fear of everybody that supports the animals, is that as long as he is out and able, he will have more dogs and more dogs will suffer. And he's, he's proven that three times now. So our biggest concern is just making sure that no more animals suffer. Now we reached out to the Humane Society of Tacoma and Pierce County and they say they are expecting to receive the dogs that are taken from Givens property tomorrow. They are also calling on the community to do, uh, donate whatever they can in order to make sure that these dogs get the care they need while the investigation and trial unfold. For now, we're live in downtown Tacoma, Lionel Donovan, King 5 News.